He dated Sherry Papini and says he knows firsthand that she's a world-class fantasist. She's a compulsive liar. She would, you know, not talk to you for three or four days, and then all of a sudden there'd be some fantastical story about what happened. Shaheen Davari says he dated the mom when she was a 20-year-old youth counselor. Get this, he says he was just 15. In retrospect, sure, tons of red flags, right? But she was a counselor that was... Uh, going out with a 15-year-old kid. Now 35, the professor of communications says Sherry's lies were never-ending. For example, she kept insisting she was a skilled surfer. I surfed all the time when I was 15, 16 years old. It's something that I really enjoyed doing, and she told me that she surfed as well. There was always an excuse as to why she couldn't go surf, and she had to have her surfboard that was at her house but didn't have any pictures. He says there was also a mystery medical condition. She was faking a heart condition at one point and eventually like not only me, but a bunch of people figured out that that was not true. What did you think when you heard that Sherry Papini was kidnapped? I was like, there's no way, she's fine. I promise you she's fine. There's just no chance that she got kidnapped. Papini was arrested Thursday, accused of faking the abduction that riveted the USA in 2016. Three weeks later, she was found wandering, bruised and branded. Sherry claimed she'd been kidnapped by two Hispanic women who put her in a closet with a bucket with kitty litter for her to use as a toilet. She claimed they held her with a chain hooked around her waist. But cops say Papini was actually hiding out at an ex-boyfriend's residence here in Costa Mesa, California. To support her story of a kidnapping, authorities say Papini asked the ex-boyfriend to punch her in the face, which he refused to do. She then purposefully hit her head on the bathtub and the bathroom floor. Authorities say the boyfriend told them Papini also asked him to brand her. Today, the man who dated Papini when he was 15 says he is being wrongly identified as the guy who allegedly hid Sherry Papini. He wants to set the record straight. I want to stop people thinking that I am the person that hid her or helped her or had any contact with her. Sherry Papini is charged with making false statements to a federal law enforcement officer and engaging in mail fraud.